wakey wakey! <laughs> Today's vlog is the what that says on that board there. Right there. And this this place is it's probably the cheapest place you're ever gonna stay rubbing and sleeping on the street. It's that cheap. It's also a bit noisy. It has its ups, it has its downs, which I will explain in, a, in this vlog in a little while. But while I'm on the street, the location of this place is absolutely superb because 3.5 kilometers that way is central, downtown central Jakarta which is where I go to the Saranar and enjoy a few beers on the on the open top balcony there and also just a couple of hundred meters down there on the left is McDonald's McDonald's cafe and Dunkin Donuts and a few others <laughs> if you go 100 sorry 1.5 kilometers that way you will come to Glodok and Chinatown. So you can either go down market or up market. And also that way, you've got KFC, Burger King, and Starbucks. And also right on your doorstep is Indomart. And if you can see another 80 meters or so, is Family Mart. And Family Mart have their own coffee shop as well. Location for me, is everything. Right then. Let's go to the quiet section. <laughs> Welcome to the Capsule Hotel. I've got to be quiet. Because <laughs> people are probably still asleep. But this is Capsule Hotel. Jakarta. And the name that I cannot pronounce is the name and the title and the address will be linked below. It has a few features. It comes with a blanket oh, and a pillow. <laughs> it is a bit like living in a shed. It's bunk bags surrounded by some space age plastic. But it has some really good features. It has a TV built in, headphones. If you want to listen to the TV, it also has a mirror. Here, you can change your light settings. Oh, we can go green. We can go blue. Oh, the blue room. What else we got? Yeah. Green. White. Off. White. Green. Blue. You like the blue? Or pink? No, no, Sammy, you like the pink. And then green again. Let's go blue. <laughs> and if you want to see, put the white on. Put the white on. Also has its own aircon. Fan. Which is controlled by that. Has two USB sockets. But unfortunately, no plug socket. You do need to put your card to get it to work and no credit cards don't work library cards don't work metro rail cards don't work matter of fact the only bit of plastic that does work is that so welcome to the capsule hotel experience <laughs> now, which to be honest when I tell you the price you'll be amazed and uh, uh, this is your zone let's go back a bit of blue you like that. off white green 
Blue, blue. Could have fun in here and do some space movies. You could utilise the space to do whatever you like. But you can't do that. <laughs> to go back. We're all right, all right, all right. Right. We'll turn the fan off. The TV is there. Comes with a remote. We'll turn that off. And I'll get that off because I'm starting to sweat. I will need my key. Because I'll take you guys. Oh man, I need to put my jeans on as well. As we open the shed door. Being in a Red Dwarf movie or episode of Red Dwarf. <laughs> you do get a fresh tile and they'll change it whenever you want to change. Right, hang on, I'll put me I'm gonna put some clothes on. Right, so that's me. I've got the top bunk right there. We lock the door. You will need your key to get in. Click it in day. And this area is aircon, so it's really cool. Click this button. The door will open. As we enter the communal area. <laughs> With my bags are ready packed to go. Big mirror. And your locker. You will need this key. And there is my locker. You've got plenty of room in there for most travellers. Storage. You can close the lock. And then to reopen you will need your magic key. As to get into your bunk. Right there. Now there are two plug sockets right there. Ah, where you can put your computer on to do a bit of work. <laughs> this morning is the communal bathroom. Yes, you have to share. Oh man, so it's good to come in after he's cleaned up. You've got a nice smell of Dettol rather than shh. <laughs> come in your toilet. One there. Oh, I don't mind walking about, he's had a clean up. One there. It's kept relatively clean. Sick. With a really good mirror. So there's no excuse for not having a shave today. And a shower. Now it is warm in here. Another sink. We're walk around. Two toilets, two sinks, and two showers. For I believe to share, I'm not sure if there were eight or ten capsules in there, but this is the male section. As I now go down through the female section, and upstairs is a mixed section. So we go downstairs. It's a female section. So it's 12. I said eight or 10, it's 12 to a floor. It's just the same as the blokes, but it's for females. 
obviously the girls aren't as enterprising as the guys. And then we go down to the ground floor. We're going down <laughs> to the ground floor where there's a communal eating area. And here is the kitchen. There's a toaster, there's a kettle, there's fresh water, and also a selection of coffee and sugar. It has a rice boiler. It also has cups, crockery, cups, plates, spoons, and a sink to do your washing up. Now I have emptied the freezer, but it is a really good freezer, and the fridge. Ah. And I must remember my cashew nuts. And there's a tin of bintang there. That I might sink before I go. So it's really cool as we go out towards the entrance. Management. Good day. TV with the latest movies where you can sit here and watch. There's also plug sockets so you can come and do a bit of work and you are straight out the door there is a night security guard who sits there and you are straight out onto the main road <laughs> as I haven't got my feet on I'm not going to walk outside it's a bit noisy so you will need airplugs airplugs in the capsules because you can hear the noise once you're in your bunks so bear that in mind so if you are coming here air, air plugs are a must what a cool area man look sink community area sit chat here you can sit and eat there's a big bin there you can see the place is kept clean and tidy big downside internet is terrible. <laughs> you can imagine the more people that come with the Wi-Fi, they're all clogging onto it. So if you're a YouTuber like me and you're uploading vlogs, videos, to give you some idea, one of my vlogs took 20 hours to upload on the internet. That is, for me, a big downside. But there is a massive upside. <laughs> if you go into booking.com, and book one night, 97,000 repair. But if you speak to the guy directly, as I did, and I booked another three nights, he charged me direct through the site 212,000 repair. Just over 12 quid. Four pounds 20 a night. Four pounds twenty a night for your room, shared kitchen, shared bathroom or whatever, which is kept clean, and a shared locker room, and it's safe. And every floor has CCTV. It's got to be a big bonus, right? That has got to be perhaps the cheapest accommodation you're ever going to find. <laughs> So it's got his ups, <laughs> and it's got its downs, and that is, and it's all non-smoking, which is superb. If you want to smoke, you can go outside and sit with a security guy. But, so, and there's aircon here. Look, every floor, sitting in these rooms. So if you were a lady, entrepreneur, you'd sit there, plug in. It's a wicked little place and it's cool. Chilled. <clears throat> this is my first well, mix oh, yeah, yeah. room and also the first time I've ever been in a capsule. Right. So that is today's vlog. The capsule hotel. So until next time. Okay. Oh, wow. Uh, thank you.